Adam is so snaky. He's he chose Kendall and then he kissed Rosie. Hello everybody, it is me Alice and today I'm going to do a Q&A because I uploaded a photo on my Instagram and asked you guys to ask me questions for this video and you guys have some great questions for me to answer and most of these I haven't even mentioned like on my channel before and are really interesting so yeah, so without further ado, let's get on the video You start a YouTube channel and I think it was my internet friends like I had like a lot of internet friends who had the channels and I was like so like obsessed with their channels like their editing skills were amazing and all of them were like Alex please make your channel he's so good at it and I was like no I won't be I won't be I'll be awful but I was so like like I don't know how to explain it my friends basically forced me to make a channel and I did and honestly it's the best thing which has ever happened like they me like learn how to edit like add like thumbnails and everything and they just like helped me and I'm so grateful for my internet friends because otherwise I wouldn't be here today basically so yeah. it's would you rather be Kylie Jenner or Kim Kardashian by the way I love you oh I love you too and I would rather be Kylie because she has a makeup range and as you can tell from my channel and Instagram and basically everything I love makeup so I would rather be Kylie over Kim because I don't know like I just love her makeup and she just like seems so nice and her daughter Stormy as well is so adorable so yeah I'd have to be Kylie any day Saturday job when you finish school Um, I applied for Primark and Superdrug as like the job that I leave school and exciting news I finished school on Friday the what day is it I finish on Friday the 15th of June which is so exciting because I feel like year 11 has been so quick and these exams have dragged so much and I only have like five exams left I'm so excited to leave because like these exams are just taking a long time and I think everyone in year 11 just can't wait to leave school so can't wait for that and I asked what is your favourite makeup brand and kind of like shop like shoe brand Um, so my makeup uh, my, my makeup favourite my, my favourite makeup brand would have to be well, I have a few, so I like NYX because they're, they're lipsticks, like their NYX lingerie so lipsticks are amazing, so I love NYX. I also love Kat Von D makeup because the, her foundation and her shade light palette is so gorgeous and they're just re like really good quality. And I think my other, I can't even speak today, and my other favourite makeup brand will have to be Too Faced because like, it's just like the packaging so cute and like the quality of their makeup is insane as well, so yeah. Georgie asked, what is your favourite high-end and drugstore makeup product? So I think my favourite high-end makeup product would have to be my Kat Von D foundation because it covers every spot on your face. If your skin's breaking out, a foundation on your face, you will not be able to see any pimple or spot on your face, which is so good. I'd have to say my favourite drugstore makeup product would have to be Dolce lipsticks because they last all day and the so Emily asked, hi Emily, I love you so much. Um, do you hope to be when you're older? Um, I think I would like to be like a photographer maybe but I don't really know because like I don't know yet or maybe like a makeup artist because like because after school I have a makeup course where like obviously makeup so hopefully like something makeup industry maybe but I don't really know yet so I really asked do you prefer high-end makeup or drugstore makeup? To be honest I can't choose because like, like, I don't know because like dr drugstore makeup is like up in their game like every like week like they're bringing out a new product every week I don't really know to be honest so both really Adam is so snaky he's, he chose Kendall and then he kissed Rosie and then and then he made Kendall leave Love Island and Kendall was like my favourite person ever she was so nice and Kendall has been through so much her fiance broke up with um yeah broke up with her basically and he left her on her own and then and then she she was so insecure that Adam left it left her and now she she'll find it even harder to find love and I feel so sorry for Kendall and actually will will miss her so much and I just can't believe Adam is still in there. Like he needs to move his bum out like I'm, I get so angry about Adam, like every time I see his face, I get so like angry, so yeah, we've run over. <laughs> right, 
what's next? You and your sister get on. Yeah, like I think us two are like so close. But love makeup, similar interest. We've always been close, I suppose. So yeah, and I uh, love her so much. What's your favourite eyeshadow palette? The Morphe 35O palette. That is one of the nicest palettes you will ever try. If you haven't got it, buy it. Because if you are obsessed with like pinky red eyeshadows, you will love it. And the pigmentation is amazing. Favorite shops. Primark, Superdrug, Boots, Debenhams, TK Maxx. For shoe shops, it'd have to be Foot Asylum, JD. What else? I think that's it. River Island as well. I love their clothes. Yeah, basically. People know about your YouTube. Like, ev like basically everyone in my school knows about my YouTube. I don't know how, like, I, like, I, like, only told, like, my friends and basically everyone like found out and literally like every girl follows me on instagram like on my sprinkle of Alice account it's actually crazy because i don't even know how first year i gained like a thousand subscribers which is really weird because i was like i'm like really boring like i don't know how anyone watched me like you know what i mean but yeah so everyone knows like friends family probably neighbors everyone so yeah someone asked who are your favorite singers my favourite singers are Dua Lipa and Ariana Grande. Their music are incredible and they're both so gorgeous. So like, have you seen them? Ariana Grande is five foot, so she is like, an, like a, is it an inch smaller than me? Because I'm like five foot one and I'm like really short. So if, if Ariana Grande is five foot then, damn, she is tiny. Um, but I love her and also Dua Lipa is amazing. Like, I, I did her concert. And she sounds so much in better in real life. Like, like her music is isn't anywhere, but her concert, she sounds ten times better. Like, I can't not describe. Like, she's just so good, and you can tell I'm obsessed with her. And I play like her music like every day. So, am I a fan? I don't think so. Her perfumes. You seriously asked me that? I right. Sorry guys, I'm gonna have to try and find my favourite perfumes for you. Wait a minute. So guys, I have three favourite perfumes. I will go through them all and I might like rave about them so much. So so like if you hate perfumes or you're just not interested then you can click off. But yeah, I'm just gonna have to like explain. So perfume it's the Ariana Grande Sweet Like Candy Perfume. As you can tell the packaging for a start off is incredible. Second thing it smells of like sweet, so really like nice and like sweet. Like I don't know, like pink smells like this. Pastel pink smells of Ariana Grande's perfume. It smells incredible and look, it's so cute and it, it's just like Ariana Grande in a bottle. It's really cute, so I love that one. Dior perfume, which I'm actually wearing today and it smells really nice. Like it kind of smells, I'll, I'll try to like explain it to you. It's like, oh, I can't even open it, here we go. Like, it smells like fresh and like really like a nice perfume and honestly like in like in like House of Fraser they have, hu they have huge ones of these, they're massive and it's really cute as well like the small one. Lancome perfume, it's the v it's the La Vie Estbel one, cream formula and honestly cream perfumes last so, so much longer than spray ones and it's actually sm this smells like nice kind of like sweet scent as well which is really nice and I can't believe that Boots gave me this for free like usually it's like £40 for this but Boots if you ever want to go and work experience go to Boots you will not like you, you won't regret it because they give you like free stuff and it's actually so good so go there so I hope you enjoyed this video if you did make sure to leave a thumbs up and a comment down below and I'll see you in the next video bye